Welcome back to Magic Tarot Cards. This is Jasmine. I have your daily energy for August 12th, which is tomorrow, Monday, 2024, for all zodiac signs. Yeah, let's see what's coming in, and then I'm going to do a uh, Oracle Chakra card at the card at the end. Uh, first, I'd like to say if you want a personal reading contact me with the number down below and i'll get back at you don't forget to buy my cup the link is in the description description box down below and uh you can manifest good luck and health love and money also don't forget to hit that notification bell so you'll be reminded when i upload another video and this channel is branded you do not have permission to use it or copy it without my permission all right so let's get started what is your daily energy for August 12th, 2024? August 12th for all Zodiac. Oh, look at that one. Just flew out. I do work with spirit, and they're the ones that pull the cards and give me psychic abilities to pull cards. Yeah, I've been psychic all my life. I've been doing tarot for more than 30 plus years. I'm the real deal here. If you want the truth, come here. All right. We'll get that straight. Trolls, be out because nobody cares about you, trolls. We don't care what you say, what you think. If you disrespect me in any way, shape, form, or fashion, you will be booted and your page will be deleted. Remember, I have eyes and ears everywhere. What's done in the dark will come to the light. And if you think you're talking about me in the dark, believe me, it's going to come to the light. <laughs> you may just be talking to one of my people. <laughs> All right. Yeah, take that any way you want to. Okay, let's move forward. August 12th, August 12th, 2024. All zodiac signs. We're going to pull one more. August 12th, August 12th, 2024. All zodiac signs. Let's see what fell here. All right, we're going to go ahead and do that. All right, we got a lot of cards here. All right, first we have the Knight of Swords. Knights and Page cards are always messengers. So what do you see here? Horses mean movement. He's flying, rushing to the air, trying to get there as fast as he can. You see the wind is just blowing. Blue is deep thought. So this person is in thought about what they want to tell you. All right. He's a messenger. What's a messenger? A messenger is going to give you news. If you notice, there's birds in the background. Birds represent messages coming in. So this is something that's very urgent. So this represents an urgent urgent call look at the flames dancing flames in tarot when you have dancing flames there's no wind or air blowing here but the flames are dancing that means spirit is here all right spirit has come and spirit is with me all right so there's no air blowing here i don't have the air on i don't have the fan on or nothing like that they dance on their own all right and they're really going look at that so i'm always protected by spirit Okay, and so there's an urgent message coming in, something that you need to know. Um, it could be from a uh, Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius, or anyone for that matter. But pay attention to your surrounding events is what I'm hearing. Your surrounding events and see what message is coming. It could be a message that's going to cut because this is a sword, so be careful. And then here we have the lover's card. This can mean many things for many people. Usually it's sexual activity. Someone either wants to do that with you and only thinking about that. Or you could have great, great passion, a great in sexual encounter. You know, anything to that effect um, that's coming in for tomorrow. Some of you could be experiencing that. So, um, yeah, I mean, if that's what you're into, hey, go for it. And if not, be careful because someone has... Uh, sex on the brain <laughs> all right so um yeah i would i would just be careful be careful all right so the lover's card is gemini libra and aquarius all right and then we have the eight of cups here so some of you are going to finally be walking away you might be walking away from a pisces cancer scorpio or you might be a pisces cancer scorpio walking away you've decided hey i'm putting down everything that once meant something to me I'm putting it down, and then I'm moving forward because I want something better for myself. I am passionate. Wearing red, even his shoes are red. If you notice that, I'm passionate about finding what is better for me, and he's going up the hill. 
all right uh blue blue represents deep thought and then there's lots of turbulence here he's moving away from the turbulence trying to go to smoother waters so i saw i see a lot of you deciding to do that putting people that no longer serve you for your higher good putting them away situations friendships relationships whatever doesn't serve you for your higher good i see you putting that down putting it away throwing it away and you're moving forward good for you all right, now here we have the magician. For all, now, this is all signs, so this represents all signs because we have the pentacles, the cups, the swords, and the wands. This is uh, the opportunity to manifest anything you want to. So when the magician is here, all you got to do is move forward with your plans. Make sure you pay attention to detail, but move forward with your plans. He has his power stick up, showing his power. He has pure intentions because he's wearing a white robe. White means pure and innocence, pure. And then very passionate with his red robe. Lots of flowers here, very uh, fruitful um uh, uh, environment all right and then the yellow represents bringing in good things so move forward if you have plans like that because i do see you succeeding and then we have some of you that are going to be resting taking a time out this is a gemini libra and aquarius as well it's time for you to meditate you see how he's tired he feels like he can't go on so he lays down and he starts praying and he's meditating he feels imprisoned restricted so some of you might be feeling that way kind of imprisoned restricted maybe mentally or maybe some of you went to jail or are about to but you decided it's time to take a time out from life from whatever it is that's restricting you imprisoning you or in your mind it's time to take a time out and pray and meditate which is not a bad thing always pray prayer is the most important thing that can get you through anything remember god can do anything now here we have the king of swords this is a person that is a higher up and they're in deep thought about what they want to say to you. They have a message for you. Here's the birds. They have a message for you. So some of you might be dealing with a higher up that's a Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. Or you might be a Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius that's dealing with a higher up that wants to say something to you. He's passionate about what he wants to say. He's in deep thought about it. But remember, swords cut. So it might not be such a great thing that they want to tell you. So just watch out for that. And then last but not least, we have Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. You might be getting a lot of opportunities now coming in. These these are the cups from the heaven, from the heavens, from the universe. They're floating on this cloud coming in. So you're in deep thought about all these opportunities. All right. You have everything here, but be careful because there's a snake in one cup and then there's a... Um, a dragon in the other one and this one's covered up you can't even see what's underneath it so you're blinded to this one but you have friendships relationships you have home you have um money and jewelry and riches here good luck all right so be careful with these two so just everything that glitters isn't gold just remember that so be careful and choosing you know one of these uh, opportunities is coming in uh dig into it first uh find out the final print the final detail don't sign any contracts until after mercury is over which is at the end of this month and then you can sign contracts yeah and so just be careful with that all right so that was for all zodiac signs now we're going to do your chakra oracle your wisdom oracle cards what message do we have for august 12th for all zodiac signs what message do we have for all zodiac signs for august 12th Oof. let's see what this one is renewal how about that wow that goes perfect <laughs> perfect with what we were talking about so what is renewal Okay, so this lady is taking the time out. She's meditating. She's off in the woods by herself. You see all that's radiating from her. That's her energy radiating from her. New plants are growing here. So this is a new beginning. She's trying to start a new beginning. She wants a renewal of her life. She's putting everything back. She's passionate about what she wants. There's green here representing uh, good things, peace. She wants peace, love. See, half of it is green and half of it is dark, representing she's putting the old behind and bringing in the new. If you notice that, here's the old and gray here, and then here's the green and new here. So she's trying to um, renew her life, renew her thoughts, renew her energy. She's trying to find people that are with her frequency, 
um, on her level, and that's what you need to do. Always find people that are on your level, your frequency, that you match with, your energies match, all right? You always want to be with someone that their energy matches, all right? So this is not a bad card to have. Uh, everyone always needs renewal or time to think about it. So some of you might have an ending and you're thinking, oh no, I have this ending, but actually it could be the start of a new beginning. Because remember, anytime something ends, a new door opens. So that's what this literally represents, uh, a renewal and awakening of something. And the key words here are regeneration, awakening, and fortune, all right? So yeah, this is a great card to have along with all these here. They go hand in hand. This is your uh, chakra, wisdom, oracle card, your oracle message from spirit. And then you have your August 12th daily energy here. All right, y'all, that's it for now. Thank you for watching. Please tell your friends about me. Don't forget to watch the other videos. Like, subscribe if you haven't already. If you want a personal reading, contact me and I will get back at you. I'm still running the $10 special to the end of the month. You get three cards for three questions for $10. That's very good. All right, y'all. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time. Love you plenty. Bye-bye. <laughs>